creativity takes courage and one person who has copious amounts of it is local artist Lleiki Gwenllia. Sam caught up with her at Cardiff Castle. My family was always really supportive of us pursuing art and I think I always used to doodle when I was a child in school so I think at some point I learned that a colleague Miriam Duivar did a full-time arts course and I think I was going through my rebellious teenager period so I went I'm not going to do science I'm going to do art. I was really I was really determined to be a marine biologist for years and I just did a complete 180 and I don't remember why. But why did Cleeky decide to do this? I think maybe the cliche is that you know um, that a creative type maybe is less academic but um, I think there's, there's a real variety. Like it's, it's amazing the types of people that you meet and just the spectrum of, of different artists. Cleiky recently had her end of year exhibition which showcased a wide range of art styles. In other people's art I like things that make me think. I, I like pieces that aren't obvious maybe but I like it when you don't necessarily need a, a, an elaborate explanation for you know why this is this colour and that kind of thing. I like the piece to speak for itself. When I'm illustrating I I like to make pretty things. I like I, I want to think that you know if someone looks at a piece of art that I've made it kind of it might brighten up their day in some way. I like colourful things, you know I like I like things that you know are a little pop of colour. But what's next for Lakey? I'm going to Corsica in September to teach English. Mm -hmm. um, but after that, I, I don't know. Hopefully make a living at, as an illustrator. And what would you say to me if I said every picture tells a story? I would say that you're right. I'd agree with you. I think the world would be a bit, would be a bit duller without artistic expression, wouldn't it?